hello guys and welcome back so now in this video we will be adding the attack button so for that in the player UI let's go ahead and click on scene view and right here let's duplicate this pickup button actually okay and let's name this button as attack button and by using this button the player will shoot and also attack okay so name this as attack button then also change the name right here in the button handler and set its name to attack okay then let's move this attack button right here okay and let me move the pick button somewhere right here so that they both are a little bit apart from each other and then let's change the source of it so we will be using this ninja sign as the attack okay so we will drag and drop that right there okay as you can see make the width of it 200 and the height as 200 so that this attack button is a little bit bigger than any of the other button okay and make sure that you name it attack then get back right here okay now on the inventory script now instead of this we will copy this and paste it right here and then in here as you know that we name it attack so we will now use attack right there let's copy all of this code okay we don't need to add it anywhere else on this script but we need to add this on the bazooka script so open up the bazooka script right here instead of this line we will paste that and right here as well okay and then let me check the other script okay we don't have to add this anywhere else but at the top we need to add this line okay so make sure that you add this line on the bazooka script then open up the rifle script then the fist fight script then the grenade thrower script and the single melee script okay so we have done it for the bazooka now let's paste this line on the rifle script then on the fist fight script then on the grenade thrower script then on the single melee attack script let's click on save all then let's select the bazooka script from here let's copy this whole line okay click on rifle now let's do changes in the rifle right here paste it and then right here as well that is it okay then let's click on fist fight right here remove this line which is set to mouse left button paste that then right here as well okay then when we are done with the fist fight let's go to grenade thrower and right here paste it as well so that on that the attack button the grenade will be also thrown as well okay then get back to the single melee right here paste it okay and then if we scroll down okay we don't need to paste this anywhere else right here that is it now save the script get back right here okay and now let me test this fully on our Android device so I will just simply click on build and run click on save yes and now let's let me show you on my Android device so as you can see it is running on my phone if I click on start okay let the cutscene finish okay so as you can see the cutscene is finished now we have the attack button now if we click on inventory here is the inventory okay let's close the inventory okay and if you notice the player UI is not actually 
moving away okay for now let's just ignore that okay let's try the fist fighting on the attack button if we press the attack button as you can see it can attack okay as you can see so now let the attack finish and now let's pick up the sword as you can see there it is let's pick up the rifle then the bazooka then the grenade then this one and the energy bottle as well okay now let me move somewhere right here alone okay so now let me click on this bag okay let's take out the sword click on cross sign as you can see here is the sword okay now if we attack as you can see it can now only attack using the sword okay now if we click on this bag again let's click on the sword and as you can see the sword is deactivated now let's pick up the rifle click on cross as you can see now the rifle is not shooting because we now have a dedicated button for attacking or shooting so now if we press the shoot button as you can see the ammo also decreases and now we have nine magazines and one bullet okay we are showing the grenade as well right there now let's remove the rifle now let's test the grenade okay let's see if the grenade works as well so let's throw the grenade okay as you can see there it is as you can see the grenade is working perfectly fine as well okay now we have three grenades left now if I click on grenade and then cross it okay the grenade is gone now let's use the energy so that we will be able to use the energy bottle okay so as you can see the player has used the energy now if we use the energy bottle click on energy bottle click on cross as you can see the player is drinking the energy bottle and the energy is being refilled okay so as you can see it is working perfectly fine okay so now we can attack using this button as you can see okay and we can now show the inventory but there is a problem with this inventory as you can see okay when the inventory is turned on it doesn't just remove the things but we type a code for that and I don't know why it is not working so let me check it out if we play the game on the simulator as you can see on the simulator it just disappear but when we use the mobile phone it dis didn't disappear these things okay so let's just fix this issue in the upcoming videos for now let's just leave this as it is